In this video, I'll be helping you with the Alex problem type called simplifying a ratio of polynomials by factoring a quadratic with leading coefficient 1. We're asked to simplify this expression. And in order to simplify a fraction, I need to get the same items being multiplied in both the top and the bottom. So if I have multiplication and something being multiplied in the top and the same something being multiplied in the bottom. Since this is multiplication happening in the top and multiplication in the bottom, I would be able to cancel these terms that are the same. In this expression, however, I have addition and subtraction in between. So looking at the numerator, there's nothing that I can do to factor v minus 8. They don't have a common term that I can factor out. So I'm just going to rewrite that v minus 8. However, the denominator v squared minus 64, v squared and 64, those are both perfect squares. So to represent that, I'm going to rewrite this as v quantity squared minus 64 is a perfect square. It is 8 squared. And if we recognize this as the difference of two squares, we know that when we have something squared minus something else being squared, we can factor this as the first term without the square minus the second term times the first term a plus the second term. So going back to our problem, we have v squared minus 8 squared. That will factor into v minus 8 times v plus 8. And now we recognize that both the top and the bottom have a v minus 8. And that's going to allow us to cancel the v minus 8. It's important, though, in the numerator since we're canceling the v minus 8, that we are left with a 1 in the numerator. One way to think of this is that the v minus 8 that's up there is really v minus 8 times 1. So when you cancel the v minus 8, you still have the 1 left. It's sort of a placeholder. In the numerator, we have our v plus 8 is the only remaining expression. So we have simplified this to 1 over v plus 8. 